is that a game like that like where there's lead changes, another walk off? Yeah, um, you know, I mean, I think last night's game prepared us for the moments in this game, but our team did a great job battling, especially at the end there. Um, that one inning, I think the fifth inning, we let the, them get back in the game with the runs. You know, that's kind of the reverse of what we did last night. So we had to catch up, and now we had to keep battling to the end. And I think we had some key hits with two outs and uh, the bottom of the seventh and the bottom of the eighth. So, um, you know, we did a great job, Rena and Jesse coming in clutch at the end there. But, uh, you know, things fall our way sometimes and things don't. But, you know, this is Arizona softball, and we're here to compete. And what do you think about Jesse having to walk up after she had that throwing error? But I'm sure she was down there. Yeah, you know, I think I think the best thing is that you know it's it's a two way street with with Jess. She can she can play defense and she can hit. And um, you know, if one thing doesn't work her way, she has the other one to kind of back her up. But um, she's always going to pick herself up. She's going to pick this team up. And you know, I know she's got my back just like I got hers. So we're just going to keep uh, working through the kinks in the infield. And you know, our day's going to come where we're going to we're going to be a little bit less more relaxed in the infield. Not as much stress or press for outs. Talked about that stress. Um, I mean, what was it, the mental mistakes? Because there was a couple that, that were just uncharacteristic for you guys. Yeah, you know, I think I think most of the time it, it's the physical mistakes. You know, we we make the routine catches. We have the, you know, the minor overthrows or the missed balls and stuff. Like, those are, to me, those are physical. Those aren't mental. Um, and, and those are the mistakes that you want to have because you can fix them. The mental mistakes are the ones that are harder to fix. And um, I think our team is really checked into what we're doing. We just have to be more efficient and more effective with our outs um, in the infield, outfield, on defense and on offense and I think that you know it's our time's gonna come we're still working through it we're in the learning process and um our battle is really what's keeping us in these games right now and I think that's great how did you, it, no, I'm sorry, go ahead. How did you feel kind of down the stretch that game you a lot of pitches it's pretty warm out here yeah um you know the best part about warm weather is that you never get cold <laughs> you only stay sweating and really hot and um you know, it's, it's Arizona. I've been here for four years, and, you know, I, cho I chose to come here, and um, I knew what, what I was going to be in for with the weather, but, you know, today was a nice day out, um, and I, I think that as we go on, and that's when our battle really started to show, and, um, you know, my team came up and said, hey, like, we got you. You just got to get us, so I was like, okay, I'm, I'm going to keep us in this ball game, and I'm going to rely on you guys because I know you can do it. As a pitcher, how did you stay focused through those errors, through those mistakes? You seem like battle through it. Yeah, um, you know, I mean, they, the mistakes weren't the only things that happened. They got a couple key hits, um, pretty pretty deep ones. So, uh, you know, those are on me. I got to be a little bit better at um, perfecting those pitches in those situations and just trusting my stuff instead of trying to place it in certain spots. But, um, they, you know, we, we got the outs that we needed. Um, we kept them from going ahead, and uh, we, we came back strong in the end. Thank you. Cool. Thank you. Thanks, guys.